Hi Gemini, this is Shah from Charlie's Angel Tarot and it's nice to see you again. I hope you've had a good month and this is your romance reading for October 2020 and I'm using the Transparent Tarot and the uh, Tarot of the Kingdom. That's this one. And I'm also using the TLC deck, Oracle deck, for the soul and the answer of the angel, angels. Okay, if you would like to see more ways uh, of the that how I've used the um, transparent tarot, then have a look at this week's um, and the two, uh, last week's and the week before, because there you can see how I've used them differently, because I use them layering, and that's what I'm going to do here as well, and listen to the introduction of this week's general readings, because there's a lot of new things happening, and please, if you welcome back Cyber Angels, and if you're new, you've just landed on this channel, then welcome, please like and subscribe and hit the bell, and set your settings in YouTube uh, to receive notifications and in your mobile device. At the end screen there is a video that will show you how to set your settings. Okay, so here we go Gemini and we start off with the Six of uh, Pentacles. Okay, so if you're less fortunate you might be receiving a gift this could also be a helping hand, a listening ear. If you are more fortunate, then you might be the one. You might be the one that is giving to an other. This could also be your partner. For the f uh, the first card of the Tarot of the Kingdom, we have the Hanged Man. I think it's done beautifully. A whale just drifting in the ocean. Okay. So something might be delayed, a gift might be delayed, you might be waiting on somebody to give you a helping hand or a listening ear or a gift. This could be delayed because of uh, the COVID or other reasons. Um, I don't, perhaps you might be wanting to get married and somebody said to you, I will help you, I'll give you uh, uh, some money. F uh, towards the wedding or this could be towards a house something is being delayed okay this could be four hours four days four weeks or four months the hanged man is also um, a, um, a spiritual card so it mean it also means you might be taking times out uh, might be taking time out and you might be delaying a situation, perhaps something in the relationship, perhaps delaying marriage um, or getting married. Perhaps this could be also a delay in the post of a wedding gift or a wedding dress, something as simple as that. But it is also an advice on getting a different perspective whilst you're waiting. Okay, so get a bird's eye view. What is happening below you? Have a look like a bird's eye view. Get a different perspective. If I lay this card, the Six of Pentacles, on top of it, um, it is happening above you. So you might be getting a helping hand, but it is being delayed. It is still going to happen by the looks of it, um, as that is uh, what this card means. Okay. Sorry if you just heard uh, a background noise. They're busy doing the landscaping outside. Okay. Then the second card we have is the Nine of Pentacles. So the money is coming in if you've been waiting for money or for that gift. Okay. There's an ending to difficulties, an ending to delays, and now you can step into action. You There is an ending. Where there is an ending, there is a new beginning. So now you can come together. Perhaps there's been a delay of getting coming together and helping each other within the relationship. Okay, wow. 
Oh, this is a beautiful card. The Eight of Fire. The Eight of Fire is the Eight of Wands. Things are going to happen one after another really fast. It's not going to rain, it's going to pour. So you're going to be getting very, very busy. If you are getting married, or if you are coming together, you might even take a break together, as the Eight of Wands also means travel. Perhaps that is what you've been waiting for, uh, perhaps a pay rise, or your holiday money coming in, or a tax return, and now you've got it, and now you've got the money to go on holiday. But you'll have to, the news that you're going to receive could be about this promotion, it could be um, about a pay rise or finally that you've got the job and you're going to take time out before you're going to start this job. It is orchestrated by the Divine and by the Angels. The Angels have your back. Ooh, that is beautiful and I love that picture. She's looking to away to the other side, to the future. This is the future. Okay, so now you can make your plans and get everything in order. This news could come through email, telephone call, or text message, or by post, airmail. You are moving away from difficulties. Wow, you've got the Six of Swords. That is literally moving away, moving home. Okay, that could be also be moving home. You are moving away. Now you can see the future. Perhaps you're moving in with each other. Perhaps because of the COVID, you were living in one side of the country and your partner was living on the other side and you were in lockdown. You couldn't travel. But now you can travel. Although um, it was suspended um, or you might not have had the money, now you can move in. Now, perhaps you might have bought a house together because the money has come in, that promotion, that job. Um, so, you are moving away from rough waters, rough times, difficult times, into smoother water and calmer times. Like I said, it was orchestrated by the Divine and the Angels. The Angels have your back, big time also in your relationship. You also will be receiving news. Before I go on to the page of fire, because there's a lot of action, like I said, there's lots happening all at once. You could be moving home, you could be going on honeymoon if you are getting married. Okay. If you're moving in together, you might also take a holiday before you move in together to take peace or moving in together and then going away on holiday. You will be receiving news. This could come from a younger person. This is the the page of fire and the page of fire is Sagittarius. It could also come from a Sagittarius, but don't forget Aries or um, Leo. Um, also, there is lots of action. This news m could mean uh, be that you have to come into action because fire stands for action. Okay, a creativity. You might have to be creative. You have the twelve here. Then that's three. That's creation and expansion. Great stuff. Look at this. You have the news that you are going to move. You can move. You are, perhaps this is official news by um, an institution that says you are allowed to travel. Then we have the number 21 and that is the world card. The world is your oyster. And yes, look at this, the rainbow. It's represented by the rainbow. Um, so that means to me heaven and earth is connected. That is a sign from the divine that they are helping you. So you've got two messages of the divine and the angels showing you that they have your back. 
the world is your oyster what goes around comes around what goes up must come down this is also the card for moving home or going on holiday going up to the next level in your relationship okay so you're going up to the next level and the world card also represents the four elements this could be with a Taurus uh, an earth sign a water sign an air sign or a fire sign and I don't see really anybody specific except for the page that is Sagittarius but it could be anybody this reading remember is general if it doesn't resonate with you then um, have a look at your moon sign or your rising sign the world also means that the world is your oyster you can choose anything you can do anything so long you believe it yourself and you take action accordingly then you have the two of earth the two of pentacles and look at this it's like if she's in the mountains and the mountains are above the clouds and she's growing and the two of coins is you might have to balance your home front life and your working life in order to maintain the balance within this relationship and two to me we also signifies that you are coming together and if you want to uh, to come together then this is your world and you will be branching out I also see expansion expansion within your relationship moving away from difficulties perhaps you had dif financial difficulties and now it's telling you the world is your oyster and balance your finances okay and remember that the other half is just as important as you so love them nurture them and communicate with them and take action in showing your appreciation your gratitude your love so that you can receive it back tenfold because like I said what goes round comes round what it goes up comes down this is my karma card if you give out you'll get it back threefold so show your appreciation and your love take action that is what the angels it says the TLC car, uh, card is peaceful soul your soul is in balance as you have the two of Pentacles you are balancing you've been warned if you're not doing it so take action if you haven't done so yet let the peace return you're a peaceful soul your soul is a refuge of peace and that's why your partner loves you if you're hooked up and if you're not hooked up you could be meeting a new partner so long you are balanced and you take action if something is not in alignment with who you are ask yourself am I willing to accept what is being presented to me if that is not the case ask am I prepared to change what needs to change uh, needs changing sometimes what shows up is not yours to heal so stay away from other people's drama you cannot help other people sometimes okay it is often better to send up a prayer for help to your divine friends the rainbow always remember that that gratitude for what you already have serves at the ultimate tonic for soothing your fearful heart don't fear just walk away from other people's drama you can help but there are people that keep on returning and returning and keep on asking loans that they don't pay back or a listening ear or a helping hand tell them if somebody is like that in your life this can also bring stress to you or your relationship and get you out of balance okay sometimes people are too demanding in asking attention so savor yourself and your relationship and love it nurture it and hug it because your partner might feel left out 
okay if you're not hooked up then you can learn from this reading that once you are hooked up that first you then your partner and the rest comes later only help those that can help themselves and want to help themselves and otherwise advise the people that are energy eaters or energy vampires as I call them to seek professional help you can't help everybody all the time I hope you've enjoyed this reading Gemini and I wish you a beautiful month and enjoy go outside and get that peace because you can be a peaceful soul you're always ready for everybody else now it's your turn go and heal yourself and your relationship keep it in balance okay the world is yours go outside enjoy nature and the beautiful autumn colors take care please like and share and be blessed and stay safe